Hey everybody, welcome back to our Pokemon Fire Red series. In the last episode, we did the SSN, the rival fight, and a few fights around the ship to collect as many items as possible. We found like the same for Flamethrower, which wasn't bad. Obviously, because we needed to get the HM for Cut um, from the Sailor, who was not rolling very well. Which we also need to, we will need to teach, so we will teach it to be teaching it to uh, uh, wings, just to give it a different type of ta type of type attack. We'll be doing the uh, third gym. Um, with that, I'm sure to make sure we've got enough healing items because we did use a couple. So, get some more super potions. Get six. So you can never have enough super potions, and what, given that we are like now level 24, 25, we could do with having more and more super potions than normal potions. So, yeah, because like, you have to be Misty to get to be able to, to use Cup, but you've got to go to uh, the go. Get to the SSN to um, be able to, you know, okay. Um, we need to have the switch. Oh, leather trainer. <laughs> Oh, I could sneak past the trainers. Yes, two Pokemon is Machoke. Oh, Rock nearly one hit him. This is back with a Kretschup, which is eight damage. Bulky. And a slow hook. Use water gun. Not as super effective. That's obviously not very effective because we're rock type. And she's using rock on rock. Then uses confusion. But doesn't do much damage either. Level 26. Okay. Okay, there's a switch. It's a one in two. I picked the wrong 50 50. The one, the one, the worst one to have the light switch in is like the one that's right in the middle. Okay, this is one in three. Oh, we've done it. I, we, we had to take on um, this guy for Surge purely because he's unavoidable. He has a slow king. That's quite. That's kind of ironic. One trainer has a slow poke. Imagine if, the, imagine if the trainer we haven't, we haven't fought has a slow bro. It's quite bulky. Um, he uses Growl. Uh, we'll use Rock Team to try and weaken it that way. I don't know. And I thought it might have... Um, Psychic and Psychic. Rod you missed. These are what again. We'll use Rod once more, then we'll probably switch. Probably. For a Quasar. Oh, no, no. We'll switch for Proton. I reckon Proton might be able to. We'll be able to do Sonic Boom. Oh, 
Okay, it's ground type. Okay. Yes, we get the pro we get the pro uh, the paralyze. Oh, that's annoying. So we will we will switch for uh, Rayquaza. So it has shed skin. Tackle did two damage. Rayquaza is it, it's Rayquaza. Pretty much. Pretty much it's Rayquaza, and Rayquaza does what Rayquaza wants. Okay, we'll heal before the gym. We'll use our own healing items. We'll use our potions, because it'll be just as easy. Um. Because we're going to save the super potions until we actually need them. But yeah. We'll probably lead with Rock into the into the gym fight. You're electric Pokemon, will they? Are you, are they are usually going to be electric type. Are you surge protected? <laughs> As a shopper, it's normally ghost so it's normally one type not overtly strong so two hits should take it down wait why did one why did one do half health yet the other one didn't he's gonna Heal using two potions. Is that going to get us full health? Yes, it is. Must have had a really lucky high roll then. Uses knockoff. It's super effective, so knockoff's now grass type? Who would have thought Shuppet would be able to be so annoying? We get a not very effective crit. This is Curse again. I don't see what the point of doing that is, because realistically he's got no heal or healing at him. And we can just finish it with Water Gun like we do. Uh, Croconaw. Uh, we'll, we'll switch to Proton. Sonic Boom! Like, Sonic Boom is such a good strategy for a... for... for... for, for, for early fights. Because... The majority of Pokemon won't have that high over like 60, 70 health. Uh, in the mid, in like the mid, like level 10 to level, uh, level 15 to level 20. So you can do like a solid third, third damage. I think uh, Proton level um, 25 has only got 69 um, uh, health. Um, that's what happens in Magic Out. This gym has not really had any then, has it? Just saying. Uh, we use Dragon Claw. One hit. Magic Cat survived Dragon Claw. Uh, Ancient Power. Not very effective, but. Oh, like, any person not very offensive. Does that mean it's like uh, psychic go, psychic dark, one of them types. Not bad. Yay, the thunder badge. That's badge number three. This T ball. It's shockwave. No shockwave. 
Swap type in a shockwave. It is. It is poison. It, no, it's ghost type. Ooh, cool. That's that, that's like really cool because that gives me a potential to get that to. Then I, I don't know if Nemo can learn it. Okay, we can leave here. We're gonna heal and then next episode we'll progress back from Cerulean to from. Look for end route two. That might be next. That that might be the route off from Cerulean. Oh, we know that be um the the the, the, the HM for Flash, which means we have to go to Rock, go 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 through Diglett's Cave. We'll do that. We'll do Diglett's Cave and hopefully that guy and go east from Cerulean next episode. But that because we'll be enter this episode with the gym badge. So thank you for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe, and until next time, see ya.